Let me show you the easiest way I found to convert CMYK or RGB color mixes into Pantone using Illustrator. First, select the parts of your logo with colors you want to convert to Pantone. Typically blacks and grays don't need to be converted to Pantone because printers will just use black or tints of black ink. Open the Recolor Artwork panel by choosing Edit, Edit Colors, Recolor Artwork. Make sure that you're in the Assign tab, then click on the icon next to the color sliders at the bottom of the panel that looks like six swatches in a grid. From the flyout menu, choose Color Books, Pantone plus Solid Coated, or Pantone plus Solid Uncoated, depending on which version of Pantone you want to generate a swatch for. Pantone Coated is typically more vibrant and is used for printing on coated paper, think things that are glossy. Pantone Uncoated is usually duller and used for printing on matte substrates. Once you've picked your color book, press OK. The Recolor Artwork panel chooses the closest matching Pantone colors and automatically applies them to your selected artwork. You can find the new Pantone swatches in your swatch panel. You're done. It was that easy. I usually just use the Recolor Artwork panel to convert my CMYK mixes to Pantone Coated because I find Pantone Coated is often a better match for my original color than Pantone Uncoated is. I just choose the same Pantone number for the uncoated swatch and call it a day. But if you're extremely meticulous when it comes to color matching, you can follow the steps on the tutorial for both coated and uncoated. You might get different Pantone swatches for both. Hopefully you'll never have to use a Pantone swatch book again. Thanks for watching.